So Miss Maddie only assigned us with a little chemistry project. We decided to do a video. We're gonna take a little nature walk. We're gonna learn a lot about the world, the air, you know, all the, all, all the elements. Ooh. Right here we got one of Thorson's famous tickets. I think it's made out of like carbon, something like that, some cool elements. We got some guys over here. Oh yeah. Now, if you're gonna waste some H2O, this is the way to do it. You know, you just keep the faucet running. Don't do that, don't waste the H2O. The H2O is valuable. You see this tree right here? I'm breathing O2 because of it. This tree, this sturdy tree right here, it's giving me O2. But then, in return, I'm giving it CO2. I really like what this grass is doing here. It is filtering the nitrogen. It is releasing fresh nitrogen back into the atmosphere. And as that nitrogen comes back to the ground, it is refreshing it, it is recycling it, it is filtering the nitrogen through the grass. I love this. Man, you see this car right here? Super nice, isn't it? But we don't know the effects it has on our real world. It causes a lot of pollution. So this car right here releases a colorless, odorless, it's very deceiving, it's a deceiving type of gas. It is CO or carbon monoxide. It releases that into the O2. That hurts us and hurts plants in the world around us. It's very sad. The sun right here, it's the biggest thing in our solar system. It provides light, energy, and it is mostly made up of the two lightest things in the periodic table, hydrogen and helium. Let's take a moment to stare at it. Those amazing facts about the sun that my man Kyle just said are so incredible because the sun is like the heaviest thing in our entire solar system, but it's made up of the two lightest elements. We got this fantastic garden here. It's probably giving off a lot of oxygen right now. Very healthy. So now we're in the woods. We're admiring these beautiful plants right here, releasing tons of O2. We're providing it with a lot of CO2. It's a very mutual relationship. I love it. You see this massive living space made up of H2O right here? Great living space for creatures made up of oxygen, hydrogen, carbon, all that other great stuff. Yeah, so I really hope you guys enjoyed our journey through nature. We learned a lot about the elements today. Fantastic work from my man Kyle. Mm, I know. Great job.